action on life begins. Oh, and by the way, your instructors are not found among the living, but among the dead. Where will I spend eternity? was discovered in the dumpster of an alleyway behind a store by a convenience owner. Multiple gunshot wounds to the head. No positive ID was found on the victim, so we're not able to notify any next of kin or any individuals that might be able to offer a positive ID. Rigor mortis has already begun to set in. This body has already begun to stink. We don't know who to contact at this time. Dr. Nimmons, how may I help you? Hi, I'm Frederick Nimmons Bennett, but you can call me by Dr. Okay, okay. Um, I'm glad we're just finishing up a preliminary examination on the body and no positive, I no ID was found on the victim, so he's considered a John Doe. Uh, we need to get a positive ID, and, and un, you know, unfortunately, might, we might find that from you. Uh, so if you can step up here and let us know if this individual is somebody that you, you know. I'm sorry, ma'am. I know it's difficult. Is this someone you know? I know it's difficult, but what, what is this young man's name? Angelo, why didn't you listen to me? His, his name is D'Angelo Harris. D'Angelo Harris? Yes. Okay, all right, thank you. I know it's difficult, I know it's difficult. Man. Jennifer, man, Pookie. Man, what's up, man? Did you tell me, do you need something? Is everything all right? Is everything all right? See who again? What are you talking about? Um, you, you're obviously distraught, ma'am. You sure that's a good Roger, idea? Can I see him again, please? Well, yeah, here, here he is. D'Angelo. Oh Jennifer, I'm right here. Let's let's go. Let's let's go. Oh Looks like man, that looks like me. Nah, nah, man, man, how did I get there? I'm over here. No, nah, this can't be me. That can't be me. Yeah, the last thing I remember was me and my boys riding on those fools who looked at my girl. Yeah, that's right. Man, we lit them up some fierce. Man, we just rolled up on them and bang. Man, it was on. <laughs> you know, I bet they never look at my girl like that again. I bet that. <laughs> yeah, I'm the man. That still doesn't explain why I'm here. Wait a minute. Think, think, think. Now that I think about it, I do remember one of my boys going down. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Yeah. But it couldn't have been Pookie. 
Because I just seen a witch in them. Dang, dang, dang. Man, y'all know who it was? It was D who got shot. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, I know they got him. Man. I think D was driving the car. I know who it was. It was my ace, my main man, Stilo. Man, I know he took the bullet for me. He ain't never leave me hanging. Yeah, that's right. It was Stilo. Now that I think about it, man, I think Stilo was running back to the car. Well, if it wasn't Pookie, D, or Stilo, then who was it? Nah, nah, nah. That can't be me. Nah, man, I can't be dead. Nah, man. Man, I'm invincible. Can't nobody kill me. Man, I'm the man. Man, this can't be happening to me, man. Man, pops left me when I was 13, so I was running things at the house. Making money, driving nice cars, had any woman I wanted. And ain't nobody mess with me or my boys. I, man, I dropped out of school. I ain't care about no education. What was I gonna do with it anyway? Go to college. Yeah, right. Man, college is for suckers. College is for losers. Yeah, college is for losers. I wish I could have gone to college. I wish I could have grown up in a better neighborhood. Man, why did my daddy leave me? Man, he left us with nothing. He left my mama with nothing. He left my brothers with nothing. What was wrong with me? Why didn't he want me? I can't be. No. and faceless young people of our society who die senselessly in our streets every 